play some ball, all right? Yeah. Yeah. Whoa, hey there, Timmy. What are you doing with that camera? I'm making a documentary. Oh, is that right? On what? Joey Lavender. He's my favorite baseball player. Timmy, did you know that some people might say you're stealing? I'll take that as a no. Well, Timmy, you're not the only one. Hi there. I'm John Johnson. If you're like Timmy here and plan on shooting a documentary, you better be careful. Violating intellectual property laws can put your movie and your piggy bank in serious danger. So be sure to follow these steps before you start filming. First, get a release agreement from everyone you capture on film, especially if they're famous, like Joey Lavender. Otherwise, they may sue you for commercial appropriation. Next, get permission to use any logos or trademarks that appear in your film, like the one for Coca-Cola here. Otherwise, they may sue you for trademark dilution. Finally, be sure to get permission to use any copyrighted material that might appear in your movie, like movie clips from past games. Otherwise, they may sue you for copyright infringement. So, Timmy, how does that sound? I don't want to make a documentary anymore. <laughs> well, Timmy, you run along now. Well, there you have it. Avoiding intellectual property lawsuits when shooting a documentary is as easy as one, two, three. I'm John Johnson, and this has been Stealing Home, how to get the rights to your documentary. So long.